Energy is the ability to do work and produce changes. In this video, we're going to study the different forms of energy. Chemical energy. This energy is stored in some substances such as food or batteries. When you eat pasta, your body receives energy from carbohydrates. When you use a mobile phone, the battery transforms chemical energy into electrical energy. Electrical energy. This is the motion of charged particles. For example, televisions use electrical energy. Electricity reaches homes and factories through metal cables. Thermal energy. This energy is related to the movement of atoms in an object or substance. The more movement, the more temperature, and therefore, more thermal energy. We use this energy to heat food, buildings, and so on. Nuclear energy. This type of energy is stored in the atomic structure of matter. Scientists release this energy by breaking down the atoms of radioactive materials, such as uranium. This is done in nuclear power plants. Radiant energy. This is the energy in the form of electromagnetic waves. Light is an example of radiant energy, known as light energy. We use light energy in flashlights, cameras, computers, cars or streetlights. Sound energy. Sounds are produced by vibrations traveling through air, liquid or solid object. The waves make our eardrums vibrate and this allows us to hear. Mechanical energy. The energy produced by motion is mechanical energy. It is the energy that allows people and things to move, go faster or change direction. We use mechanical energy to produce motion when we ride a bicycle or push a shopping trolley. There are two types of mechanical energy, kinetic energy and potential energy. Kinetic energy. This energy results from the movement of an object. For example, the bicycle transforms the energy of your muscles into kinetic energy. Potential energy. It is the energy that results from the position of an object. For example, when you lift an object, you give it potential energy. <laughs> 